Hi guys, um, I've been asked a few times now to make a video showing how I mould my bath bombs. Um, so I thought I would whip one up really quickly. I'm going to do three colours in my little two inch Zen moulds. Uh, we've got yellow, green and blue. The blue is closer to an embed mix. A little bit different but yeah, it's one to one citric and bicarb. These are just regular bath bomb mix. Alright, so I'll just whoops, show you how I do it. So I'm going to grab a little bit of green, a little bit of yellow, a little bit of blue, like so. I'm going to use green as my middle colour. So what I do is I just make sure there's a bit in there. See? I'm not packing it down or anything, there's no need. A little bit of yellow, a little bit of blue, a little bit more blue, and green in the centre again. This is a bit of a wet mix, this one. I added a bit too much liquid, but does it matter? Okay. So I've got a mounded one here, a mounded one here. And I'm going to smoosh them together. I'll turn this way. Might be able to see it a bit better. But see how this mix is a little bit wet. Slightly wetter than I usually make it. But I think it's because I halved my mix and I realised halfway through that I had measured out my liquids for a regular batch. So I just tipped a little bit out, hoping it would be enough. So that's what I do. There, so they join together. Then you can just squeeze it a tiny bit and lift it up, turn it over, squeeze and lift. I used to tap but now I can't be bothered, I just squeeze. So we go and put him down there and we'll do another one. I put blue on the bottom this time, bit of yellow. Bit of green. Again, just mound it. You don't need to shut it down. There is no need. Bit of yellow. Bit of green. Just enough that you've got enough there to shove the two halves together and know that they're going to compress it enough, okay? So we'll do it again. Again, this is a much damper mix than usual. So hopefully there's no humidity today. I may have issues with these because I've added so much liquid. And there we go. See? Now you can squeeze all, like I said, I used to tap. Let me see if I've got a spoon. Here we go. So this is how you tap, right? Just tap the seams a little. And you should be able to just lift it off. And same for the other side. Oh, that one doesn't want to. Tap off. A little bit of a seam. See? Okay, I'll do one more and then I'll turn it off because otherwise it'll take 10 years to upload. This time I will use yellow for the middle or I'm going to run out of my green. Yellow. Bit of blue, bit of green, bit of yellow. These gloves are full of sweat right now because it's quite warm in my house. It's disgusting. Okay, so here we have our mounded halves. I've only packed them in a little, I mean, normally your mix would be a little more powdery than this, but like I said, I added a little bit too much liquid, but it's the same, same process anyway, so it doesn't really matter. So you've got your two mounted bits, shove them together. You're going to get more falling out with a powdery mix. Obviously it's not going to stick like this, it'll just fall off. But um, yeah, so just shove it together. See, I'm shoving that actually quite hard, but these will still float, these ones. As you shove it together, wipe around so it's nice and clean. And I'm just going to squeeze this one. Squeezy, squeeze. I hope that's focusing. I really do. That'll be really annoying if it's not focused. 
squeeze and lift, flip it, squeeze and lift. Okay, so that's all I do really. I'll show you once more, right? Just once, gosh. Get rid of that. And then I've got to do this really quick because my mix is going to dry because I'm just floating around with this video. A little bit more in there, I think. I hope you can see all this too because I'm not really paying attention to my camera. A little bit of green. Don't forget the green. Oh my goodness. All right. So I'm going to mount this on. doesn't really matter how much you mount. You can make a huge mounting because most of it's just going to fall to the side. I'll turn around this way again. And we're going to go shove, shove, oh, it's so hot in here. Okay, cleaning it up, can you see, hope I'm in focus here, nice and pretty. And we're going to squeeze, and flip it, and squeeze, and there you go. Lovely. Okay, I hope that helped. Um, that's how I do my two-inch bath bombs. Nothing to it, really. Um, I will see you in my next video, which I have no idea what it will be. Something interesting, hopefully. Bye!